So just got a new lav mic. And while I was doing some testing, I noticed that sometimes I would get some background hissing noise on the recording. And sometimes I would not get background hissing noise on the recording. Uh, specifically in my setup, I was getting the background hissing noise when I was recording directly into my iPhone. Uh, however, I was not getting the background hissing noise when I was recording directly into my MacBook into uh, Reaper. You know, so I think it's safe to assume that depending upon what devices you're using and what software you're using, you may or may not get some background hissing sounds. You know, not to worry, this can be easily handled with noise reduction in any DAW. For this demo, I'm just going to use Audacity. I'm using Audacity because it's freeware. You know, anyone can download it. It's pretty easy to use if you're not familiar with DAWs. So the first thing is I'll go ahead and we'll play this little waveform. Now you'll notice that in between the speaking parts, the meter will come to rest at about minus 36 dB. Uh, and that's the hissing noise. Um, you may not actually be able to hear it on this video, but if you had headphones on and you were listening to this, you would be able to hear the background, uh, the background noise. So, Let's take a quick listen. All right, so this is just a test of lavalier mic going right into uh, my iPhone. So there it's hovering on minus 36, and then that's the end of the recording, so it goes down to uh, zero. Um, just take another quick look at that so you can see it again. iPhone. So there it is on 36 and then going down to zero. Now for the noise removal effect, it's a two-step process. First step is to to select a section of the noise that you want to reduce. This is a pretty good section right here. And then you go into the effect uh, menu and scroll down to noise reduction. And the first thing is to get the noise profile. And now what that's done, Audacity has concentrated on this selection and built an internal structure so it knows how to remove those frequencies that are causing that hissing sound. Step two, after having the noise profile made, is to highlight the entire waveform. Go back into the effect. Go into noise reduction and hit OK. And there you have it. Now you can see that the uh, distortion on that line has pretty much disappeared. So let's take another, another look, another listen, and see what happens to the meter. All right, so this is just a test of lavalier mic going right into uh, my iPhone. All right, so now we're going down to about minus 48 uh, dB. Um, and that should pretty much remove the hissing noise um, from the audio. Um, all right, so that's how it's done. And with that, uh, we'll see you next time.